Good evening, Fano. Um, we just jumped off the Sunday session for the Kahal program, um, where we listened to an amazing wahine by the name of Nicola Te Kiri, um, who really shared with us a lot about her business journey and some amazing gems of business advice, tips, and tricks. Um, now, Nicola, she was the top student. Um, that graduated from the Kahal program last year, um, who then went on to do um, some more one-on-one -on -one coaching uh, with Travis. And to see where she's at within her business um, and how much she has made it grow in the past year since being in the Kahal program, ultra inspirational and real testament to what you can actually get done if you really commit and put your head down and put all these things into action. Um, such as, you know, she went deeper into, um, you know, the analytics, understanding data, um, doing little tests and um, experiments, you know, with your top fans, um, all for market research purposes and to, um, to know how to adapt and change so that you're best serving your customer avatars. Um, I really resonated with her whole story, um, her whole life story, having, you know, um, become a mum and then had a relationship breakdown, which then caused, you know, a bit of a disconnection from self, low self-esteem. Um, but then the healing journey that she undertook through personal development and, um, you know, reading self-care books, which then reawakened that creative um, inside her, um, which then got everything into motion um, towards creating her business um, with her tamariki as her why you know this exactly the same why that I have to show our children that you know they can do and create anything that they want to create um, I also really resonated with her um, how she said she had always taken a real wairua approach to her business um, and this is something that I definitely do you know I follow my flow I follow my energies um, and I follow my wairua when it comes to making um, choices and decisions um, and she sort of um, explained you know that when you reach that next level, um, you know, still keeping that way to a led, um, you know, approach, but there is a lot more to it, such as the data and the structure. Um, I also loved how she touched on the self-limiting beliefs that we have as growing business owners, such as the imposter syndrome, which is something that I feel like I suffer from all the time, being in coaching, telling wahine what, you know, guiding them as to how to live into their best selves. If I'm not living into that myself, then it makes me feel like a hypocrite. Um, these are just some of the 